everybody. Welcome back to Taz's Weight Closet. This is Taz. Today I want to start something fun. I talked about doing a summer series earlier this year, and even though it's not quite summer yet, it's barely spring, I know I have to do a lot of uh, planning ahead to do something like this. So what I thought might be fun is that I would run a summer series, um, maybe 8 to 10 videos, and it would include all kinds of uh, cute summer hairstyles. So wigs that are cool, um, that are shorter, that move like a breeze, just really fun and flirty styles for summer. But I want to kick that up a notch. So many of you have asked me about my fashion sense and things like that. So I thought I might do a pairing. So I'll show you a wig, but I'll also feature maybe a cute little outfit that you can wear it with in the summertime. So what we're starting with today is a brand new style release for 2019 by Aesthetica. This one's called Perry. It's in the color Silver Sun RT8. And then um, in terms of my outfit, I am just a huge fan of layers. I think layers are amazing because you can, um, you can go from different temperature ranges and either take some layers off or put some layers on to make yourself comfortable, but I also think that it's a really flattering look as well. The outfit that I'm featuring today, um, I really love wearing white in the summer. It's so fresh and classy and perfect for any summer occasion. Um, I've paired a basic white t-shirt with a very thin gauzy type blouse. I have on some cropped jeans and some strappy sandals with a heel. I can wear the blouse um, off of the shoulder for those cooler summer days. A layer just like this blouse, you can always remove it and tie it around your shoulders. You can also tie it around your waist. This clothing here that I've had, I've probably had this for four or five years, so I really don't have links that I can show you. I can just kind of show you um, how I am putting outfits together so that maybe you can go to your own wardrobe and select pieces that you could apply that same method. So I think just a, a layered look like this just gives a really classy style. And with a cute little boy cut pixie, you can put your collar up a little bit. The Perry is uh, one of the shortest styles that they offered in that winter collection. And I think it's just beautiful for spring and summer. So this Silver Sun 8, I actually have a review out there of the Aesthetic of Violet in this color as well. I think that it's the, the color is fairly consistent. Um, on this one though, I just see a very a, a light pale uh, silvery blonde but mixed in there a very very palest of like gold platinum and then all of that on a medium brown root so this is one of those colors that if you were just starting to transition into some maybe gray colors um, or white that this would be uh, an amazing transition color because you've already got your silver but there's still enough blonde in there to kind of keep it firmly as a blonde and I think this color is beautiful for all for all ages so this is a real shorty let's talk about these specs so your your longest piece here in the is going to be the front piece and that's about a six inch front piece here so that's going to reach nearly to my chin if we stretch that out probably to the bottom of my lip there and that's the longest section or layer on this style. In the back you have a four and a half inch crown, which I love a little bit of a crown that gives you a very beautiful profile. And it's kind of true to that boy cut nature. Um, on the sides, on the sides you've got a 1.25 inch size. And I tried to find that and I did find it. You'll see it in this little bit of an undercut right in front of the ear. And I love that. I think that's amazing because it's going to open up so much styling options for you um, in the summer for ear tucks and things. And then the nape is super short. It's only 1.25 inches. So I'll turn around and show that to you. Uh, you're going to want to put up your bio hair very well. You're probably going to want to shave your neck. And if you have a problem with your hairline going down too low, this may not be for you. 1.75.
So in short pixies like that, I generally sweep the hair around the ear because sometimes I have escapees that are right behind the ear. So I sweep that around and I can usually get away with it pretty well because my hair is super short and I do shave my neck on a regular basis. This style only weighs 2.2 ounces. It's super lightweight, perfect for warm weather. It features a lace front and a left monofilament side part. Let's go ahead and linger here. So the knots on this lace front are, are average. Um, I think that it's done very well. The, the mono part there is a little harder to see. It might be a little more thickly threaded there, but it does run all the way back to the crown. So you see these sides do poof out a little bit here. And that's because that, uh, uh, that, that front layer extends back over to the ear. So like I said, there is that little bit of an undercut, but for the most part, when you have it down, you get a little bit of volume right there above the ear. The fibers are feathery and wispy fine. That's another reason why I featured this one in my summer series is because it feels so lightweight on the head at 2.2 ounces. But not only that, uh, just the, the wispiness of the fibers is just a flirty uh, summertime look. I think this style has beautiful light texture to it. Um, it's not a spiky style, but it certainly is not a bluntly cut on the edges. It's, they've been a little bit notched there to give it a nice modern look. And you can certainly pull out a lot of texture on this wig. So the density. The density is, is light. Um, as you can imagine with these fine fibers and these short, short layers, uh, it's just a very light density look and feel. The permatease. This one actually has quite a bit of permatease around that monofilament part um, at the crown. Virtually none at the nape as it tapers down into that 1.25 inch nape layer. So you just feel the bones of the cap there. And then there's just a little here at the sides. Most of your permatease is going to be at the top. And I love permatease on a short style so that I can get some really spiky volume on the top. inside of the cap for Perry. Uh, there's your lace front. It's a seamless unit back into that left monofilament uh, part there and it does extend it back into the ear tab. The ear tabs are closed. You do have the classic incremental strap type adjusters and extended open nape. There's a lot of wefting here and that's really important on a pixie like this because you, it gives you maximum coverage. So this one doesn't seem to be uh, as stretchy as some other Aesthetica styles that I've seen, although I did have to take in the adjuster to fit my petite average circumference. So let's talk about styling for Perry. I think that you will look super smart in your glasses in this style. I think they fit very nicely between the ear and the ear tab. I find that accessories are super cute with your short style. Even if they're not functional, they just give you a little extra personality. And with the longer front piece, like these six inch uh, bangs here on Perry, I think there's a lot you can do. So uh, you can change that part wherever you like, but let's just keep it where it is and put it up with a embellished bobby pin here. So because of these longer front pieces and this beautiful texture, I think you can really play it up. You're going to want to grab some, I think this would be the perfect style, to grab some uh, John Renault contour fiber cream, some sort of styling paste, and kind of work it into the root and pull it out and just create some beautiful up and over styles. So even though you do have that left hand monofilament side part, <clears throat> I love parting it on the right. 
Uh, it's this here is a rooted color. You really can't see any of the wefting. There's a lot of tight wefts there, so I really feel, and there's permatease, so I really feel like it will be obscured nicely. So this is my favorite way of wearing it, actually, and I would put some holding cream or spray on those on the top there. Pull out the texture and flip it over. I would tuck that right piece behind the ear. Since we're working with some higher looks here on this style, I think you can easily brush behind the ear, expose that little undercut there in front. You can get a really chic off of the face look on this style. That would be the perfect evening look for summer. Thank you for joining me for this review in my summer series. This is Perry by Aesthetica in the color Silver Sun RT8. And we got a look at a cute little summer outfit. See you next time on Taz's Wig Closet.